estate, most of the time, the independent looks at the real estate and the site selection, and they think, oh, I can't do this. There's no way I'm going to be able to figure out where to put a site. I got to think about the spots that are available and the price and whether or not I can afford it. But they don't think about how easy site selection can be if you're looking from 30,000 feet. What they think is how difficult it is because they instantly talk about psychographics, demographics, market share, traffic count. Oh, data. It's data. And that's what scares them. Versus the first step should be get the map, look from 30,000 feet, plot where the people are living, plot where the people work, plot where, the, where their uh, homes are, their businesses are, where restaurant row is. Plot it. And when you see it, then you take the next step which the next step, usually you don't have to pay for. <coughs> I can go to a commercial real estate person in virtually any part of the country and in markets around the world, and I can say, listen, I'm wanting to buy some space or lease some space. I need you to help me find the right space for my restaurant concept. I've already looked at it from 30,000 feet. I know the map. I'm going to give you the rough area that I'm looking for. And guess what they'll do? They'll bring you all kinds of data. Guess what the cost to you is? Zero. Because they're wanting to lease the space. They're wanting to sell the space. We get folks all the time calling our office wanting us to help them with site selection. We'll help them with site selection. We're somewhat expensive. But we'll help you. But the reality is the data is virtually free. And the reason I say virtually is because I'm not paying for it, but I'm charging you for my time. Versus if you just went and got it on your own, you wouldn't be paying anybody. Because that person is wanting to lease the space. Now, you, what you, here's what you got to understand. They're going to give you all kinds of crappy spaces to look at. They're going to give you junk. And you got to be able to look through the junk and say, yep, yep, nope, yep. And then you got to drive it. And you've got to think in terms of the art of site selection. And you'll be able to determine which spot <laughs>